What was your experience like shopping for health and life insurance before I helped you? The problem I kept running into is they seemed to have a product they wanted me to buy and the savings wasn't significant enough for me to change. I'm only going to save seven, eight or nine or 12 bucks a month. You're not really saving me any money. So I didn't go with any of those things. And they did, they seemed rather inflexible. And uh, it seemed like they had straked out territory and didn't want to touch on the other guy's territory for some odd reason. Okay. All right. Second question. What do you appreciate most about my process and services now that you have experienced them? Uh, first of all, you listened. So you gave me the product and services I actually wanted as opposed to what you thought I should have. Uh, approximately $1,600 this year in savings. Uh, for my medical coverage that covers Part B, I went from $176 a month to $86 a month. That's a significant savings. Uh, on my prescription drugs, since I have went through the same account, the GTL, they have a program that if I buy a drug, I get a rebate on the drug. One of the drugs I take is Leprinacil. Out of pocket expenses were $7.95. But since it's not a non-generic drug, they gave me $20 for that prescription. So I actually got paid for taking the drug. Um, and all you have to do is take the little bill and send it to them. You don't have to make out any paperwork in about 20, 25 days, they'll send you your check. All right, so last question. And you can improvise as much as you want. What would you say to someone who may be on the fence about getting covered with me? Um, what I would first tell them to do is take a look at what you're spending and what you're being covered for. And unless you really need that level of insurance, like you're hospitalized a lot, there's not a reason to pay for it. Uh, best thing to do is have him come in, sit down 10 or 15 minutes or 20 minutes. He can show you. I'll give you an example. I didn't know that in with life insurance, that when you terminated that policy that you got a cash rebate, you got your money back. I did not know that. No one ever told me that. The agent originally that I was going to change from, um, change to his company did not tell me that. And so he was going to do what? Allow the other company to keep my money? Or allow the other company to bill me till I was out of my money? See, and so there's an honesty there that you have to appreciate. And, that's about all you can ask from anybody is honesty.